Noah's Ark 3D image is set to be revealed. At least they think they found Noah's Ark. This is posted on Out of Mind. I'll leave a link below for you for this. A view of the controversial Durupinar site in Turkey. It's supposed to be in the area of Mount Ararat in Turkey. A Turkish Ark hunter captured new subterranean images of what he believes to be the real Noah's Ark. This is not the first location. This is not the first time we have learned about this location. Others have found this as well. Now, the final whereabouts of the biblical vessel of the Old Testament, having to do with the deluge, of course, have long remained a topic of heated debate among historians, with many unable to agree upon whether or not it ever actually existed. Among those who do believe that the story of Noah actually happened, some maintain that the Ark has already been found at the Duru Pinar site on Mount Tendurek in eastern Turkey. This large vessel-shaped formation first gained attention back in 1959, and there have been numerous expeditions to that site over the past years by archaeologists hoping to prove that it really is Noah's Ark. Now a film crew, headed by veteran Ark hunter Kem Sertesen, has reportedly visited the site with modern imaging equipment and has obtained 3D images of the alleged vessel that lies underneath. It isn't exactly clear how the images were obtained, but according to reports, it involved sending electric signals underground via cables. These are the actual images of the Noah's Ark, said Sariston. They are neither fake nor simulation. They show the entire ship buried underground. Sadly, though, it looks as though we will have to wait a while longer to actually see these images as they are going to be debuted in a new documentary titled Noah's Ark 2, a follow-up to Saracen's earlier documentary, Noah's Ark, which was released back in 2017. Whether or not they will help to solve the mystery once and for all remains to be seen. This is from Unexplained Mysteries, and it's on Out of Mind 2, and I'll leave a link below for you for this. If you'd like to join me on my Patreon account, you will hear content not covered by mainstream media. These riveting stories will be based on my research and I will state my opinions and give my personal insight on diverse and controversial subjects and world events, events not covered by mainstream media and not certainly on not supported by YouTube guidelines. So whatever I have on my Patreon, most of those will not be on my YouTube channel. Please consider becoming a member today. More of the, the most significant and important videos will be on my Patreon channel. Your support helps me to continue my research and keeps this YouTube channel alive. And we depend on your support, your generous charity, because we help economically challenged families here in Athens, Greece in Kapota, and we also help the young generation with university tuition and the community around our church. Thank you.